everyone welcome back to my channel uh, granny sewing room today I'm going to be making a coconut cream pie from scratch I got this recipe offline I just googled old-fashioned uh, coconut cream pie and that's this is the one I chose so I'll walk you through the steps of me putting it together and we'll see how it turns out and I'll try to get the link to the coconut cream pie that I used and put it in the description. Has anyone told you you're special today? If not, let me be the first because we are in God's eyes. So I'll get back with you after I get the uh, pie crust baked and cooled and walk you through the steps of putting these ingredients together. The ingredients you will need for the coconut cream pie recipe that I'm using online will be half and half, coconut milk, coconut flakes, vanilla, or you can use coconut extract. I only have vanilla. I looked at the store and it was like $4 for it. And I said, mm, I have vanilla. I'll use vanilla. Cornstarch, sugar, whipped topping for the top part and two eggs and if well of course pie crust so I'm gonna get my pie crust going in, in the oven to get it baked because it needs to be cooled and then I will get back with you to start adding all the ingredients putting the ingredients together okay be back it shortly so you have to cook the ingredients that I'm putting into this saucepan and it says you have to cook it on medium low uh, uh, double boilers better I don't have a double boiler but uh, cook it uh, for about 20 minutes 25 minutes and what you need to put in your saucepan is one and a half cups coconut milk I might have got, uh, like I usually do, too small. So it's almost, almost a whole can of coconut milk. You need one and a half cups of half and half. You need three-fourths cups of sugar. You need a uh, fourth teaspoon of salt. You need two eggs. And then you need your cornstarch. And this is a third cup of cornstarch. And then you get this a mixing and we get it over a low heat and it takes, like I said, about 20-25 minutes to bring it to a small boil. So I'll get that going and I'll kind of show you the progress as I'm, as I'm getting through it. That is the uh, toasted coconut I just got done toasting. Doesn't take long to, to toast that. And here. This is supposed to get to the consistency of thick pudding. So we'll keep stirring and cooking. So it says cook for 15, I'm rereading the instructions, cook for 15 to 20 minutes on low heat. And when it just starts to boil. When it starts to boil it says remove from heat and add three-fourths cu three fourths cups toasted coconut and your teaspoon of vanilla as soon as the it starts to boil and it takes about 15 to 20 minutes and you're supposed to be stirring it consistently. So I'll show you the next project uh, process when I get to that point. Now it's 
starting to really get the consistency of thick pudding. I don't see where it's boiling, but... And it took about 15 minutes. And I think that's plenty thick enough. So I am going to shut it off the heat and add my coconut and my vanilla to it. And let me get that ready here. It's supposed to come to a, a boil, but I'm not seeing a boil. But that's pretty thick for the consistency of thick pudding, it said. Just want to make sure it sets up when I I have a tendency to never cook long enough. That was a teaspoon of vanilla. I have the heat shut off. And three fourths cups toasted coconut. say that's the consistency of a thick pudding. So I'm pouring it in my pie crust that I've already cooked and let cool. And then I put this in the refrigerator for two to four hours until it's cooled before I put the whip crop whip top topping on it with the rest of my toasted coconut and I'll tell you what it tastes like oh that's good this is really good might have another favorite recipe and I'll put the link in the description. And I'll come back to show you when it's ready to put the whoop topping on and take a bite. I don't know, but this stuff is really good. Mm. You'll have to try this. If you like coconut, this is a good one. And we like coconut. Thumbs up. Whipped cream can only make it better. Well, I want to thank you for watching me make a coconut cream pie today. Hope you uh, enjoyed it. I'll put the link once again, like I said, down in the bottom. And um, I'll come back and show you the finished product. All right, the final result of the coconut cream pie. Mmm, mmm. Moment of truth. Here it is.
Mmm. Very good. Belly Gin has nothing over this pie. Mmm. Very good.